morning, Leslie. It's uh, gusting a little bit out there this morning. I just looked across and that was palm trees uh, flapping a bit. That don't know if it looks untidy, though. I wish he'd cut that back, you know. Because <laughs> you, well, mate- normally you can see through to the other road, but you can't. If you look through now, you can't. That's well, that, everything's that's- been growing so well this uh, this summer, hasn't it? You know, with all the rain and everything, everything's really, really flourishing. The water bats are full. They are. Yes. You know, I've got two here and they're, they're both full and the grass is, you know, saying thank you. Yes. Uh, look as if they're saying thank you for a little bit of water. Did that rain the other night? Oh, it did, didn't it? Yes, it did. Last night, lay in bed, I was listening to that, and then there's a rumble or two of thunder, and we weren't quite what I thought it was going to be, you know. I thought we were going to have a humdinger, but we didn't, did we? No, it wasn't as bad as uh, was predicted. But have you been enjoying the hot weather? Because that's been really hot this week, hasn't it, prior to that? Yeah, well, you know, you know me, Leslie. I I like a little bit of sunshine. I like I like it when it's nice. So you know, you can get out and enjoy it, can't you? Because I've been miserable for too long. Mm. And so uh, well, I think that was Wednesday. Mother was a gut aching in the morning. She was saying, "Oh, oh well, you know, are we going out today?" <clears throat> and I said, "Well, I, I, there's nothing I need from Darby's. I ain't going there. I don't want to venture too far." I said, yeah, "What well, I'll do?" I said, "We'll get get ourselves sorted in the garden." We can we can see then she she got it in her head you know because they do don't they yeah she got it in her head she wanted to go out to the seaside so I I said well, I don't know I said it's you know there's South Wales but trying to get into South Wales a job in it it is yeah you know you imagine what that'd be like on a Wednesday afternoon <laughs> in trying the to sun. get into South Wales by the time you got in there you're gonna have to turn around and come <laughs> out aren't you <laughs> so anyway where did you we, go we ended up huh <laughs> where did you go. Well, we ended we ended up getting in the car because she kept going on. I say, right, well, I said, get yourself together. I said, we'll we'll uh, we'll haul off to um, Felix Stow. Oh, lovely! So yes, we we took a ride out to Felix Stow, you know, and it ain't a bad little run, is it? You know, because that's yeah. sort of you know you get in and you, and you go, don't you? You know, you yeah, got main to, road. Yep, you got to wind through anywhere to get there. So uh, anyway, we we get there and we park up, all right, you know, and I I get a wheelchair out and I start wheeling her up the prom <clears throat> and I say we'll have a we'll have an ice cream up the end now all of a sudden she turned around she say that's too hot <laughs> so I say what do you mean that's too hot she say well she say I'm I'm getting hot I say well it's alright I say bear with me because when I get up the end we'll get an ice cream and then we'll get in the shade somewhere so anyway she shot for a bit and we, we got up the end and we had an ice cream on the front. Yep. That's nice ice cream, mine. Good. And so one of them uh, up near the pier. Oh yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know they got a, a, a whatnot there, and yes, they have and, got a uh, whatnot. Yes, all different flavours. Uh, so anyway, within another fifteen minutes, she was moaning. That was that was too hot, weren't it? So back we went to the car, and, and we ended up coming home. And where did we end up in the end? Where'd you in end the up? garden, like I suggested in the first place. You know. <laughs> well, at but least you had a ride we out. Get out and, Huh? <laughs> At least you had a nice ride out. That's right. That was busy, yeah. you know. Yeah, yeah. You know, the beach Good. was uh, was fully, yes. fully packed. You know, but every everyone keeping the distance, of course. That's right. That's good. And uh, yeah, you know. When you spoke the other day, why on the, the pro- kids have to go along now, right, Leslie, and have the old music blast net of their at their phones? <laughs> you know, we we sit there on the on the front. And there's a couple of kids come past, and they had all this. All this um, crap music playing as they went past uh, the, the shelter bit, you know. Yes. And uh, they had their own music playing. And why, why do they have to have that so loud off the phone? I, I, I don't know. Perhaps they don't have headphones. I don't see them all. I said, why can't they turn that down? I said, why do they have to walk about with that blast and out like that? But they are, you know, that's, that's what they're like now, isn't it? Well, I'm, I'm sure you did that when you were young, didn't you, Brian? Well, no, they weren't the funds like that, were they? <laughs> you know, we, we used to sit and listen to the wireless. Yes, happy days. Hey, look, the other day you were on, and um, uh, you said Marcus was getting some new outside lights. We heard last summer yeah. about his solar lights. Uh, has he got them up yet? That's right. What he's done is put a concrete um, trench, right? He's yep. put these wires down, and... Uh, <clears throat> He's now he's now filled that in because he's having some new turf laid. Yes. And so um, he's covered it all over, and he's now got two of these big 
big um, round lights at the end of the garden. He had them on the other night, right? Yes. And they shone right in the window. And I said, here we go again. <laughs> so what I'm thinking, do you think I ought to get some sort of trellis or something put on top of the fence to block that out? Or do you think that his missus will get the hump? Well, mm, it's a difficult one, isn't it? You're a funny old bugger, you know. If, yeah. When you, yeah if, if, you, you've got to watch her, because if you catch her in the wrong mood, she start on you. Yeah, she has in the past, hasn't she? Yes, yeah, she called you fat, didn't she? Yes, that's right. I went yeah. round there last year, and she say, she say you're, you're putting on weight. Mm. And that's what she's like, you see. I don't know why she has to be like that. But do you think... I could put something up there that just stop that glaring in, because when we're watching the one show, yeah. I don't want to be sitting there watching that, and then I've got two balls on the telly, <laughs> or reflecting that. The, um, the, you know, the, the round lights at the... Well, go, up to Dobby, the go up to Dobby's and get a bit of trellis. Yeah, I reckon that's the only way yeah. forward. Get a bit of trellis, Lizzie, Brian. You know, and yeah. I can yeah. nail that to his yeah. fence. yeah. And then, uh, and then that will sort that out. That'll that? be lovely, won't it? Let's know That's if she right. moans. Let's know if she moans. And how you haven't mentioned Rosemary? How's she this week? How's Rosie doing? Oh, she's she's winding me up. If I be honest, because first she had a go at me because she say I don't I don't like you telling people my business on the radio. I say, well, I can't help. I forget I'm talking to people. people. I just think that's me and you, Leslie, <laughs> and. So anyway, next week is a week when she's having this garden bath delivered. Oh, yes, yep. And uh, right this week, I, I sit there looking out the window, and she's got one of these gazebo things up in the garden now. A what? Where she's, huh? What's she put up? One of these, um, one of these uh, the gazebo things where oh, she right. okay. sit under. Yeah. She's been sitting under there, and... <clears throat> And that we're along to the right, that's where this old garden bar thing is going to go. So next week, yep. they're going to lift up a panel in the back of the garden. Yes. And then they're going to get this garden, garden bar, bar thing, thing across and put that in her. I don't know why she wants to be frittering her money away on this sort of stuff. Because I said, I said, before you, you'll no sooner get that in and the, the summer will be over. So that's going to go under the gazebo, is it? No, no, that's gone to the right of it. Oh, is that she's, okay. got, she's got the gazebo down by marigolds, where yes. her baskets are. Yeah. And then on the right, yeah. that's, she's going to have that. I mean, that'll be that'll be in the corner, you know. Yeah. I, she's done it well because she's had some slabs put down. Lovely. The neighbour, not neighbour, Marcus, um, Neil on the corner. Yes. Because he, he's all right with a bit of brickwork and slab. He's a good old boy, isn't he? He come, well, I wouldn't call him that, but he, he come round and he... He put that, the, the slabs down for, and that's where the garden bath is going to go. And well, so, you know, that, that, that'll look all right. That, but, you know, I don't, why, why people have to be fascinated with these things, I, I don't get it. I don't understand it, Leslie. <laughs> but she more or less told me to mind my own business last week. No, really? Well, you know. You I get, thought you two were probably getting cosy. She say, she, say, <clears throat> she say, you don't need to go on there telling everyone my business, mm, she say, if I okay. want have these things in my garden, I'll have what I want. Well, I'd, I'd, I'd hate to uh, to see you fall out, so, uh, yeah, we'll... we'll, we'll... Oh, fall out. I don't fall out with no one, you know me, Leslie. I do, yes. I, I can get along with anyone. Good. Can you do some shout-outs before you go? Yes, yeah, I don't mind. <laughs> All right. Josh Farrington, it was his birthday. Right. J- Josh. <laughs> right, oh, that's... that's yeah. uh, he's had a birthday. Yes, can you say hello to Josh? Yes, happy, happy birthday to Josh. Thank you very much. Uh, also, oh, this is lovely. Uh, hi, Mark. Please can, please can you ask Brian to give a shout-out to Matt Seeley and Isla Schofield. Uh, they're getting married tomorrow from West Suffolk Horse Boxes. So that's Matt and Isla. Matt, Matt and Isla, and they're getting wet tomorrow. They are getting wet tomorrow. Is, where are they getting wet, then? I, I don't know. It doesn't say. All right. Well, I, I hope they have a lovely day. What's the forecast, anyway? Better tomorrow than today. Well, that'll be all right then, won't it? Yeah. Uh, Jeanette's been in touch. Please, can you ask Brian if he can say happy 50th golden wedding anniversary for tomorrow uh, to Barry Hawks? Happy anniversary for tomorrow to, to Barry Hawks? Yeah. And Tony yeah. and Barry St. Edmunds, uh, could you get Brian to wish Dawn and I a happy anniversary, please? Ten years today, I think. Ten, ten years for Dawn and who? Yeah. Ba- <laughs> Tony. Tony and Dawn, and that's their anniversary to die? Yes. Well, that's nice, isn't it? It's a shame yeah, it's the weather in, 
a little bit brighter, but you say tomorrow should be all right. Yes, and Josie in Honington's 88 today. Is she by God? She is, yes. 88, and, and that's in, in Horrington. Uh, Honington, yes. Honington, <laughs> and uh, as a Josie. Josie, yes. That's right, the happy birthday, Josie. Yes, and Delia Smith is 80 today, Brian. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I was listening a little bit earlier because she's the one who used to do the cooking, isn't she? Yeah, she is. Yeah, she doesn't do much of that these days. No. No, that's right. When I was growing up, that was Fanny. That was, yes. uh, what's that woman? Um, Fanny Craddock. That's right. Johnny, yes. That's right. She was she was the one who used to do it all. And then, of course, they come along and old, old Delia sort of took it over, didn't she? <laughs> she Delia, did. Delia used to do the cooking. And then who was that woman, Leslie, who used to come on there and do the poetry? What was her name? Poetry? Pamez! Pamez, they are. That's the one. Now, she was good. Well, is she still alive? <laughs> yes, she is, yes. That's right. She used to be quite good, didn't she? Because she used to <laughs> sit there and get an old squit, and that was quite good, wasn't it? <laughs> uh, qu- quick word to... Just say hello to Abby this morning, will you? Abby Chapman. Abby Chapman. Okay. Hello, hello to Abby Chapman. And Ted Frost in, ta- in, in Tudnam. Ted Frost, uh, happy Father's Day. This is from uh, from Sheila. Ted Frost? Yeah. And of course, it's Father's Day, Sunday, isn't it? It is, all day, yeah. Blast, that is. I must get some flowers. Yeah. That's right. So, that's right. Happy birthday to all the fathers, then. Yes, yes. For Father's Day. <laughs> yes. Brian, have, right. a, have a nice weekend. Bye-bye now. Yeah, yeah right. Uh, cheerio, Lizzie. 